Without objection, so ordered. As a member of the House Foreign Affairs Committee, I've been a strong supporter of the U.S.-Turkish alliance. I've been to Ankara, Turkey. I have met with officials there, knew the president before he was president of Turkey. And so you can imagine my dismay, Mr. Speaker, with the recent aggressive action by Turkey toward our most cherished ally, Israel. The complicity of Turkey in launching a flotilla to challenge the blockade in Gaza, the ensuing violence that occurred, the grievous loss of life is deeply troubling to those of us who have supported the U.S.-Turkish alliance in the past. A few things need to be said. We grieve the loss of life, but Israel has a right to defend itself. And Turkey must know that America will stand with Israel in her inviolate right to defend herself. There is no humanitarian crisis in Gaza. 10,000 tons of food and medical supplies are transferred into Gaza every single week. And the blockade has saved lives. Hamas used the Gaza Strip to launch vicious and brutal attacks, thousands of rockets on civilians. It cost lives in Gaza. It cost lives in Israel. Turkey needs to count the cost. Turkey needs to decide whether its present course is in its long-term interest. But expired. America will stand with Israel. Time's expired. For what purpose,